Hello, hello, I am Mrs. Cavazos doing the B flat two octave major scale, B flat major two octave scale on the bass. So there's a lot of blip, 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 blip going up here. If you can't see my little tiny fourth finger at the end, um, it's right next to my third, but we'll check it out and see what happens. So you have um, B flat on your A string, is right here. B flat. It's not going to be a regular first finger. I don't know if you can see those tapes or not. They're kind of hard to see. But you have your B flat here. Stay in the half position for the C. C natural. D. Half position for the E flat. F natural. G. Go back into regular first position. A. B flat. You could shift for the C. D. E flat. F natural. G. A, fourth for B. There it is, you can see that, yay! Um, I have tiny hands, so I am bringing my thumb across. Um, so, if you want to see that, again, you're gonna be in half position most of the time. You're gonna have B flat, fourth finger C natural, open D, first, low first finger E flat, fourth finger F natural, G, first finger A, second finger B flat, First finger C, fourth finger D, half step, first finger E flat, fourth finger F, go a whole step for G, three for A, and then four for B flat. And then you could walk your way back down. If you're going to do the little turnaround, B flat, A, B flat, you could just do the B flat, A, B flat, and then work your way all the way up. But it's here, if you have these tapes, it's a lot easier. If not, you could use your ear, but pay really close attention to it, and you'll be set to go. If you have any questions, concerns, comments, or anything, go ahead and leave them down below. Um, like, share, let me know what else, what other scale you might want to have and play with. You'll have a super awesome day.